Good morning, everyone. I just want to do a quick video today. Uh, this is Saturday morning. We've been having a lot of rain lately, and uh, I'm not going to complain about the rain, though. I've seen some of my friends up north, and they're having to deal with snow, so I'm not going to complain about the rain. But Marie and I are getting ready. We're fixing to head over to the nursing home to visit with my brother. And we're going to take him some uh, banana pudding that Marie made last night. And uh, I just want to give you a quick view of my tomato seedlings I've got growing. Uh, and then I want to take you with us. Uh, after we go to the nursing home, we're going to ride down to the river and see how much the river's up today from all this rain we've had. So let me get the camera turned around here and we'll get started. Uh, here's my tomato seedlings. And I've got a few more that have just sprouted out, but I still got them in there under the heat. I got these in here so they can get some of the uh, sun if we get a little bit of sun today. But as you can see, everything's still wet outside. At least it's not raining today, but we are supposed to get about a half inch of rain this afternoon. But let me take you, we're going to head now over toward the uh, nursing home, and after we leave there, we'll ride down by the river and check it out and see how it's doing today. Okay, we're just getting ready to leave the nursing home, and we're going to head on over to the river, and we may stop by the creek on the way going to the river. This is the creek over here in Silver Creek. It flows on through Glendale and continues on to Rome and there it dumps into the river. Uh, that's where I'm headed to next. That's Myrtle Hill Cemetery all the way into the back. There's a 2nd Avenue bridge and the metal bridge is the old railroad trestles. And normally the river is out there on the other side of the tree that you see there. This is a walk bridge for downtown. I'm standing on the levee right now. Yeah. I like to come up here and camp. But I've never seen it that close up there, boy. I know it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. This is this is the highest it's been in quite a few years. This is locking down, and you can see trash cans are out there. They're must be bolted down because they're not floating away. But that's the. Uh, lock out there that people usually stand on and fish. Walk down this way. Back up a little bit so you can tell I'm in the parking lot right now. And that's about 50 feet away from the sign, the uh, locking down sign. And check this out over here. People's over here fishing. This is, this is actually the ramp that goes down to let people put their boats in the river. And the river's all the way up to almost the top of the ramp. And people stand out there fishing.
walk over here on this side. This is where the water came up behind. There's a creek that feeds in here. So the water's come up onto the creek and it's all the way over to the picnic area. And if my memory serves me right, I remember quite a few years ago when we had the floods, the water came up and I'm thinking it was about somewhere in this area where I'm at right this minute, which would be about another 50, 75 foot from where it's at now. But it would have to river, it had to get about another foot higher get up to here. So if I remember right when I came down here that time the water was here uh, and the guy caught him a fish. So even though the river's up the fish are still biting. I just want to do a quick video for the uh, flood waters that we're experiencing here today. I hope everyone enjoyed watching this video.